can't believe I'm going to work with wet hair. I'm sorry, I just, I, I don't have a hairdryer. Well, I'm surprised, to be honest. I mean, Steve had very little hair to dry, but you? I've got a natural way, what can I say? Oh, yeah. <laughs> can't you just spit yours up from the flat? Well, I would, but Maria broke it. Can you believe that? It's not like she's a hairdresser around, is it? Right, well, I'll buy you a new one. I want you to have everything you need at mine. Actually, I've got a spare one at the Rovers. Need to go and collect the rest of my stuff anyway. Well, I can do that if you like. That's OK, I'll do it on my break. Steve will have got the divorce papers by now. He might not be very receptive. No, it's tough, isn't it? He's got to accept this is happening. I've moved on. Right, sorry, mate. It's nearly time to hand you over to bad driver. Hey! Well, maybe we could use another cab firm. Hey, there is only one trustworthy, reliable and reasonable cab firm around here. I've, um, cancelled the delivery service. You are? Steve's fault. He's too unreliable. What if I took over? No, I'm sorry, mate. It's too late. I made the decision. You can tell your partner it's thanks to him. Um, talking of Steve. Oh, you need to go and pick up your stuff, yeah? Yeah, I know, but we're really busy, aren't we? Oh, it's fine. Daniel can handle it. It's good training for him. OK, won't be long. Mm -hmm. mm. I just came to pick up the last of my stuff. Fine, yeah. Dave, I can't find the 